as we meet here in 2024, we must be self-critical and work towards inclusive, networked, effective, impactful multilateralism that can make a tangible difference to people's life. We must also, as you know, dear colleagues, ladies and gentlemen, dear friends, include voices beyond government, the voices of our, of our young generation, the voices of indigenous people, the voices of local communities, the voices of those of the informal sector, by focusing on issues of gender, human rights, and leaving no one behind. We, have to, we need to give a meaning to this statement. In the early days of the United Nations, the issues of sustainability and the environment were not at the forefront of the international agenda. Remember those days. Today, these issues are front and center of our work every day, and I want it to be at the center of our work this week. Why? Because it has finally become clear to us that the environment is the very foundation of our economies, of our societies, and of our economic progress. As Executive Director and Mrs. Anderson reminded us time and again, we can no longer pollute our way to health. Time is running out to tackle to the, not only the planetary environmental crisis of climate change, nature, biodiversity loss, pollution and waste, but all the global environmental challenges, including desertification, drought, among others. Yeah.